Meantime, an abandoned dollar store is bringing new hope to kids facing a critical need in one Chicago neighborhood. CBS 2's Charlie DeMar takes us to Brighton Park in this original report. This now defunct, rundown Brighton Park dollar store is set to undergo new construction. It will hopefully be the foundation, <laughs> the building blocks of a new generation. At least that's Maricela Garcia's vision. This is the highest need area in the state, not only Chicago, for early education programs. This is what the proposed early childhood education center would look like at Archer and 42nd. Gads Hill Center, run by Garcia, already operates four similar locations. The new flagship center would serve about 120 children in desperate need. It is very, very critical for families uh, that um, make um, not a lot of money to be able to have options so that the children do better. Recent studies show just over 736 children in Brighton Park have access to early childhood education, leaving more than 3,000 kids shut out and further behind. They learn a lot, they do a lot of projects, they do a lot of science, art. The Early Childhood Center is going to help both me and my son. Woo! A welcome relief to neighborhood moms. I'm telling parents, you know, to go and, and see and Bye. make sure they go to a place like this. And so far, Gads Hill Center has raised about $6 million for the new location, and that money was raised through state and federal grants along with private donations. But there is still a need of an additional $1 million to make this all a reality. And, Rob, tonight there was actually a gala fundraiser to try and get them across that finish line. The, uh, re the uh, pictures of the renovation look really impressive. It does. It looks like a beautiful center and obviously will uplift this community and provide for these kids. All right. Charlie, thank you.